Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today is really big day for me because after three and a half year, I officially got onto G1 on Arena. But not only on Arena. Yesterday, I also get to G1 in RTA 20 Star from F3. So let's go and see how can I get onto. G1 from F3 on RTA 20 star. So as you guys see here, my profile have not uploaded yet. So my arena still on C3 and my special league is still on F3. Oh my god, I get on C3s again. Why? They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never Okay, I think I should do one match to get me up to G1s again. Hopefully I will meet some guy on C3 or G1. I pick first. Oh, he's on G1, so I'm gonna pick Shayna. I think he gonna pick some Kablution or something like that. So he picked Chao and Beta. So I picked Maruna and... Uh, Maruna and... Friend. So right now... I have to ban Diana. He gonna ban my friends, of course. I'm gonna take the crit rate leader. So I'm trying to kill his Chao as fast as I can. Hopefully, this Chao cannot one shot me. His it's basically cannot one shot me due to the passive. But let's see if this challenge violent or something. Almost one shot. So I'm trying to uh, tap tap on the chow. Trying to do as much damage as I can on the chow. Oh, he sleep me. Buff. Attack the Chow. If I can kill the Chow, I win. He got additional turn, wow. Oh my god. Can I stun? Trying to kill this Konamiya. Kill, please. <sighs> I think I'm gonna kill the beta first. No, right now, Konamiya. Kill Konamiya. Violent, please. Violent, I just need. Yes, violent. So now I'm thinking of killing the Chow. I cannot kill the Chow. Wow. He sleep me again. What the freak? Stun. I got one more chance. If I violent, I win. Yes, I violent. Wow. Okay, I killed the child. Is she gonna kill me? No, she not gonna kill me. So right now I'm thinking of killing the beta. Yes, I have to kill the beta. Okay. Oh my god, I won! Yes! I get on Q1s again. Yes, Q1. Oh my god. 
I was so freaked out. So that is the battle got me on Chi Won today, not yesterday. Yesterday I already get on Chi Won and my rank is um 1000, 1100 ish. So let's see some of the battle that I found, found yesterday. So this is really good battle. This is really intense battle and I won and I get on Chi Won. So let's watch again this battle. So in this battle he pick first, he pick friends, so he gonna do some kind of like slow team. Uh, and he also picked Beta and uh, Vanessa and he picked the, the bulldozer, the water bulldozer and the, um, the chow. So my only chain is like one shot the chow and then leave the bulldozer at last. But I saw that friend is the bigger threat so I'm going for friend first. And lucky for me that I'm able to one shot the friend, so she's not having attack buff for all her team. Yes. So I'm trying to uh, not attack the bulldozer because when you attack the bulldozer, you give him free attack. But I think so. So I leave the bulldozer at last because I know the bulldozer builds on um, defense. So he's really slow. So just kill the child first and lift the bulldozer at last. So that's the reason why I ban Vanessa because I don't want to like double kill, killing a target again and again and give them like 33% of speed leader. So uh, the next match I'm gonna do with this C2 guy. Uh, this match I'm pick first so I always pick for Shaina. So he go for Vampire and Triana, Raccoonie and uh, this um, Silphid, Dark Silphid. So he thinking of like one shot me. But the thing he don't realize that my Sabrina have the passive that if the opponent is on any kind of uh, beneficial effect uh, the damage dealer on my twins gonna decrease by 35% so she cannot one shot me so it's give me a chain to um, do some damage on her and uh, um, taking the heal for myself because I'm on violent so lucky for me that the Leo don't have enough damage to kill my Talia, so my Talia like heal back a lot. So the biggest threat right now is Triana because at the end, her attack gonna be like really really hurt on my twins and um, mm, she can easily kill my Talia at the end. So I'm killing uh, Triana first at the first leg before the the. Uh, Leo because Leo on RTA People don't go him on violent, but they go him on vampire So you know that he is not violent you have like the strategy that you know how many turn he can take so you actually not worry about him much and uh, The next match I'm thinking I want this one too Yes, I want this one too so I, I'm on the winning strike, strike. So he picked Garo, which means he gonna do something like trying to cleave me and trying to be super fast. So I pick four twins and I pick Amdot, even though my Amdot just on five rune. He is not like on a full full despair set, but I make him, I trap him to ban my Amdot. So he banned my Amdurt and uh, he don't have enough damage to kill my Talia then he quit. Because I already won him like at the first turn. It's like I met him twice but I already won him the first. So with the first match I picked Shayna, he picked Orion and uh, Garrow. Which is really dead pick because Orion if you cannot speak, if you cannot strip the opponent which means you already lose. So he also banned my Shayna. 
So he go first and he cannot strip anything. And I wonder why he don't go for skill 3 instead he go for skill 2. Maybe he want to get the armor break on my Talia. But he is not getting it. So right now I'm just like free kill the Garo first. Free kill the Susano. And uh, basically I won. Okay, I won. And the match before that I lose. But let's see. Let's see how I lose on this match. Maybe it's just like RNG the reason why I lose. So he picked Bastas first. He gonna go some sort of like uh, Lucian or something. I think so. No, but he go for uh, Pisama and um, Bastet. Pisama is like one of the reason I really scare. One of the monster I really scare using twins because he can do like a lot, a lot of damage. Uh, lucky for him that he can kill my Shayna first. If he cannot one hit my Shayna, I have already won this one. So I'm trying to kill the Garo first. No, not the Garo. What is name? It's like the two star, lies two star first. And I kill it. And right now I'm trying to like crowd control the uh, the Bastet. But um, he got like one really big damage. Is is the Bernard. Also the Pisama can like do a lot of damage when he die from the uh, the, the, the skill and he uh, get the passive so yeah I don't have enough damage to deal with this so I lose but thing gonna be different if my Shayna doesn't get one shot at the first play so with the next game I want to uh, but let's see what I'm doing this row. So I pick Shayna and he got Verat. Wait, let's see this again. Okay, so with this match, I pick Shayna, she pick Fran and Water Barbara King. So I pick two twins. Uh, he picked Verat and uh, the Wind Horse, so I banned Fran and in my mind I thinking like this. So okay, I move first, I get 3 buff and this Barbara King gonna not steal my wheel. So uh, he is not on wheel at all of his team. So I am free to like stun him and uh, just one shot the the win the Diana first and my team is still on will so the Virat cannot do anything so the next target I'm gonna target is kill the what try to stun the Virat first and kill the Papara King so I try to boost the attack bar of my Sabrina so that um, she can attack the water Barbara King and kill him but uh, he's still the turn but it doesn't matter I kill him in the end this three in 10 match so this Ferrat lucky for me he's not on like Alpha Ferrat so he don't do a lot of damage so he keep freezing my team and my only hope right now is killing his I changed the target so I killed the Darian first. Try to kill the Darian first. And lucky for me I killed the Darian. So this time I just like trying to buy myself some time to get some more turn because I faster than his Vera so I get more turn than him. So uh, I gonna like have more turn and I can revive. And as this I um, revive the Sabrina because I know that Sabrina have like less chance to um, get freeze by the Verat than the two other twins the fire one and uh, she is on bio so she can do bio procs on Verat and it's bring me the win and uh, let's see 
Let's see what else there is. Let's see, this is one more match. Oh, this one more match. So, two days ago I was on C2, and now I'm on G1 officially. So, I picked 2 twins first, and I see him pick the, the fire balloon. So, I know he's gonna like Lucian me, and I take his Lucian, but he's gonna be Sam on me. He actually moved first, one shot, trying to one shot my Lich, but he cannot, but. Uh, the Pisama crit on my Lucian with his Bushin. So I'm trying to kill this um, this fire. I'm sorry for getting the name. I'm trying to kill her first, but I cannot. So I decide to give my uh, Lilich a little bit of health so he can like cycle the passive. So in my head, I'm thinking like this uh, he got no stripper. He got one beneficial block, uh, so I just need to kill Megan so I can win this game. And um, actually, he got crit on my uh, how fast and I lose. <laughs> One hour ago. No, it's not one hour ago. It's like two days ago. This is like really long ago. Maybe I see this one. So maybe this is like my last battle. I'm trying to keep my rank, so I'm gonna find uh, one time per three day to keep my rank. So I just need to do two times like that to get G1. So I banned his Odin, he banned my Triana, then he got no uh, damage on his team at all. I'm not scared of Valajor, I just need to kill the Valage, then I won. There's no way he can like do anything about it, but fraying for his like Valage to proc. And I want. Oh, I'm gonna show you guys the rune of my beta. So right now I'm going on four twins. You guys can find the four twins rune on uh, my last video, my previous video. I will uh, put like a uh, a link in under the descriptions of this video. So I pick four twins and situation. Look. Institutionally, I'm gonna pick uh, Triana. She is on uh, Vile Will, uh, our friend. She is on Squip Shield because I want to uh, make her uh, have like a cap shield to make my twin tank gear if they don't ban my friend. And uh, I'm gonna pick my Beta when they trying to go on Flip Team. Uh, so that she can use like uh, her third skill to anti-crit. That is one of the reasons why I put her on Squid Nemesis. And uh, oh, and one more is Megan. She is on Squid and Will. So if the opponent trying to do some kind of like Lucian team, I'm gonna pick Megan because I don't want he to pick Megan and pick some cap like damage dealer than Lucian to one shot me so I have my Megan on Swip and Will so uh, that basically how I get from uh, F3 uh, special RTA to G1 and special RTA so if you guys like my video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe my YouTube channel. It really helped me much and thank you for watching. See you in my next video. Bye!